In this video, I'm going to show how you can send uncompressed high resolution photos, videos and any other type of file you can think of through WhatsApp. So keep watching. To subscribe to my channel on your YouTube app, you can click the subscribe button here and click the bell icon here to get notification whenever I post any new videos. WhatsApp allows us to send only photos, videos, GIF animations and document files. It applies different algorithms to compress the images and videos in order to reduce the file size. But it leaves the document untouched and uncompressed. So what it means is we can just simply rename a file and add a doc extension to it and send it through our WhatsApp. It's easy right? But that's a very tedious and boring thing to do. So to cut this short, you can download an app called send any file and it does all the job for you. So simply go to the play store. Play Store, then search for send any file. Here is it? Then install it. Now, when we open the app, first we have to grant permission. So we'll just click on it and grant the permission. Okay, first. You can send any type of file you want any type and okay let's swipe it i'll explain it to you later okay all set. okay it's all set it's done now i'll show you how to do it i'll go to the file manager you can use any file manager you want i'm going to use the native file manager here so I'm going to open it then I'll go to the SD card and then I have saved some files here this folder so here you can see I have four files here one is an apk file uh, another is you can see an, a, an image file which is 1.1.30 MB and another one is an exe file which you cannot open and another one is a video file okay so i'm going to send one by one each of them and show you how it's done first i'll send this image directly to whatsapp and then we'll send it through send any file app okay first okay let's share it whatsapp okay, let me send this okay send so it's going been uploaded now as you can see the file has been compressed see it's totally compressed you can see it's all blurry okay now we'll send this file through that app okay and I'll select this file I'll share it and now instead of choosing whatsapp I'll choose send any file okay now it's processing the image okay now it's ready now we'll choose the app and then we'll select whatsapp and again send this file here as you can see now it is being sent as a document file and this and the size is intact 1.3 mb all right now the contact you are sending this file must also install this app to retrieve the file automatically retrieving the file is very easy the person who you are sending this to does not have to rename or anything he needs only to download the app and install it then he can simply just click the attachment here and it will automatically and it will be automatically retrieved into the original format see and it will be saved in your phone memory and into the receipt send any file receipt folder okay now let's open the file see now see 
it's now I'll show you how you can send other types of files now let's say I want to send this exe file here then there is no way you can send an exe or an apk file through whatsapp so just i'll just share it see you have no whatsapp option here so i'll just simply select the send any file here and it will automatically process the file and rename it into a document file okay so it's ready now let's choose the app choose whatsapp same contact again and see now to retrieve the file all that person needs to do is click it again and it will be ready exe file retrieved now let's open obviously we cannot open that file now let's send one apk file here this one share choose the app whatsapp same contact here see it's 15 MB and it's being uploaded ok it's done again Again that person needs to just click the attachment, download the attachment and click it and the app will automatically retrieve the file. See, apk file retrieved. Now let's open the file. See, it's quite easy. And the user can later find the retrieved files uh, by going by going to the file manager then phone memory then send any file folder and received here you can see the files see and the sent files can be found here it all has been renamed by the app it is not limited to whatsapp only you can send files to facebook messenger also with the help of this app now if you like the video put thumbs up and share it to your friends because it's amazing this is amazing don't forget to subscribe to my channel okay see you later